My name is Whitney Richards, and I'm the founder of Veramarks, and we focus on early stage Lyme disease diagnosis. Um, what's critical with Lyme disease is catching it early because you have a short window of opportunity to actually treat it. And the conundrum is that current tests are missing more than 60% of people. I'm very passionate about this business because I currently suffer from Lyme disease, and I was a person that was missed by current tests. And like many people, I started having symptoms, everything from exhaustion to blurry vision, and I went around for two years trying to get a diagnosis. During that time period, I saw 16 different specialists, and I was diagnosed with 16 different illnesses, all of which I didn't have. Everything from cancers to being told I was stressed to sinus problems where I had sinus surgery. And since I had been on a business trip in Asia, they even thought I had SARS. So I ended up with a catheter in my chest, which is pretty common for long-term antibiotic treatment. And suffice it to say, I feel like the current tests failed me miserably. And so I do not want to see people to go through what I went through. And so I created Veramarks. And I've put a million dollars of my own money into the company and in trying to uh, cure myself from this disease. From a business perspective, I cut my teeth on Wall Street. I was a derivatives and structured products trader, went on to M&A, and then in the last 16 years, I've been an entrepreneur. Our CEO, David McDonald, I hired about a year and a half ago. He has more than 30 years of diagnostic industry experience. He's run half a dozen very notable diagnostic companies with the same regulatory pathway and business model as Veramarks. Lyme disease is the fastest growing infectious disease in North America and Western Europe. It's seen in more than 80 countries, and it's not getting better. So we're seeing headlines like this almost every day about how Lyme disease is growing and how this year could be one of the worst years ever. <clears throat> I want to point out, Lyme disease is treatable, but you need to catch it early. But this is where current tests are failing. The treatment is actually a round of pretty benign antibiotics, three weeks of doxycycline. It's cost-effective and low-risk. One of the main issues is, most people, when they walk through the doctor's office, do not show any symptoms of Lyme disease. So only 17% of people see the classic bullseye rash. Most people actually have nonspecific cold and flu-like symptoms and don't even know that they were bitten. As I mentioned, current tests are missing six out of 10 people. This means people don't get treated or they're be being treated for things that they don't have like happened to me. This is costing the healthcare system $2.5 billion per year, according to two independent health economic studies. So we created Veramarks. We're the first accurate early stage blood test for Lyme disease. We focus on uh, general, uh, uh, focus on uh, general practitioners and uh, pediatricians. Those are who see uh, patients first. And we have two patents pending around our technology. This graph shows you what we do better than the current tests. So it's very easy to see that our accuracy above 92% is much better than 40% for the current test missing 60%. And also important, if, if you get a negative with our test, it gives the doctor 99% certainty that you don't have Lyme disease. So they're not treating you for, for Lyme disease if you have a cough or cold. In an independent survey of 100 ordering physicians on the East Coast, 93% of physicians said they would order our test. This is because they're seeing people every day with these symptoms, and they don't have a tool to address the problem. We have $200 of reimbursement with existing CPT, CPT codes out of the gate. <clears throat> Lyme disease is already a huge market. We estimate it at $1.4 billion. They're selling somewhere between 3.5 million and 5 million of these tests that don't work each year. The CDC has estimated over 300,000 cases in the United States. And in Germany this year, they're estimating somewhere between 750,000 and a million cases. So in summary, we're the first accurate Lyme disease diagnostic test so we can get people treated when it counts. We have a huge market. We can get paid. Doctors want to order our test. We're saving the healthcare industry a lot of money. We're ready to launch. We've got great accuracy. We have patents pending. And we have a very experienced uh, management team. So I'm very excited to say that at some point this year, a little bit later, we're going to be launching our test, helping a lot of people and uh, growing a very valuable company.